Hi friends, welcome back to my channel Agape Vlogs. In this video, I'm focusing on all types of questions nurses can expect to be asked in an interview. Well, before going on to the typical interview questions and answers, I'm going to give you some tips on how to prepare for a nursing interview as well as how to impress your interviewers. So friends, here are the points to bear in mind before you step in for an interview. First point is you have to understand and know the job specification you are in for. Second one is carry out research on the recruiting hospital and the interviewing department. Third point is practice frequently asked interview questions. We will be discussing the commonly asked interview questions later on so stay tuned. And fourth one is prepare questions to ask the interviewing panel. We always have a tendency to be prepared to answer questions but you also will be given a chance to ask the interviewing panel certain questions. So be prepared to ask questions. Definitely, the first impression is the best impression. Well begun is half done. So the first impression tip is to dress professionally. Secondly, be punctual to your interview slot. That is, arrive at the interview at least a few minutes early. Greet people with a smile and make eye contact during the conversation. Thirdly, have a positive attitude. That is, speak confidently. Read the interviewer's body language. If the person seems unfocused, shorten your answers. Be prepared for many different types of questions. Interviewers may ask technical questions as well as questions about how you interact with colleagues and patients. With every question, interviewers want to determine what kind of employee will you be and whether you would be a good fit for the company or for the position. After the interview, Make sure to send a thank you note to everyone you spoke with. It is not only really polite, but it shows interviewers that you are interested in that position. Now, let's begin with some of the typical questions asked in a nurse interview. Before that, let me tell you, interviews need preparation. Some questions come up time and time again, usually about you, your experience, and the job itself. I have gathered together the most common questions so you can get your preparation off to a flying start. First question, what do you find difficult about being a nurse? Well, what they want to know is many aspects of being a nurse is challenging. Interviewers want to know which one is the hardest for you. Here's a warning for you. Do not complain in your response. Instead, keep it positive. Using your response to highlight positive attributes in your resume and personality. Like you, you can say, I prefer to look at difficulties as challenges and I enjoy conquering challenges. Well, let's look at the sample given. I think the most difficult part of being a nurse is when I have a patient that is very unhappy or in a lot of pain. And I can't comfort them to the degree that I'd like. I keep a dialogue going with the attending physician so that she has as much information as possible regarding the patient's pain level. Sometimes the patient doesn't effectively communicate with the doctor and I try to help bridge that communication gap. Well, this is an answer well said. Isn't it? So moving to the next question. Do you prefer to work alone or as a part of a team? What they want to know is, nurses often need to do both, right? Work independently and also collaboratively. So you have to be very cautious when you are answering. Be honest in your response, but avoid being negative about either work style. Let's check the sample answer. That depends on the circumstances. I enjoy being part of a treatment and support team, but I also like the autonomy of working alone. That's a brilliant answer, right? Next question, how would you handle a patient who complains constantly of pain? Here, what the interview wants to know from you is that how you tackle this potentially tricky situation. 
so here you are free to use your own examples from the past work experience if you would like to the answer would be good if you say like i would listen sympathetically to the patient's complaint and reassure him that his concerns are being heard and that we are doing everything possible to help him if it seemed to warrant it i'd confer with the attending doctor to make sure that the patient's pain is being managed in the most effective way going to the next question what do you contribute to your patients as a nurse well this is an opportunity to share your personal theory of how you help patients you can focus on the medical or the interpersonal depending on what type of role you are seeking answer is i feel that my patients know that i am there to provide comfort and understanding that i will listen to their concerns and that i act as their advocate if necessary next question how do you respond when family members ask for your personal diagnosis by asking this question the interviewer wants to access your boundaries and find out if you know how to respond appropriately so a good sample answer is unless it's my role to diagnose i wouldn't do so but i would try to dig in a bit and figure out why the patient's family member was inquiring does the person need some validation did the doctor not explain the prognosis clearly I'd seek to be helpful and share important information without stepping outside of my role. Well, steering through the next question, what interests you about working here? Any time interviewers ask this question, they are seeking to determine if you understand and value the healthcare institution. Essentially, interviewers want to know if you want this particular job or any job at all. A good answer would be, I am impressed with the model here and the collaborative spirit on the team. Just by sitting in the waiting room, it's clear to me that this practice has a patient first priority. I am eager to work with people who are passionate about providing care. that would make a perfect answer next most brilliant question asked what made you choose nursing as a career what they want to know is as you share what drew you to nursing look for opportunities to highlight characteristics that make you a good fit for the field a prudent answer would be in this case like nurses have such a powerful role in the hospital i saw that first hand when i was young and had a family member in the hospital and it made me determined to pursue the career helping people during a difficult moment is tremendously meaningful to me yes this is the most prudent answer you can give ever Going on to the next question, how do you handle stress on the job? What they want to know is stressful moments are inevitable for healthcare professionals, right? Acknowledge the stress but keep the focus on your response on your coping mechanisms. A uh, wise answer would be in the moment I don't tend to feel the stress. I am too intent on providing care for the patient and offering support to the doctors and team around me. later though sometimes it hits me my strategy is to go for a hard workout when the stress doesn't dissipate over time next tricky question how would you deal with a doctor who was rude this question can reveal if you are a complainer or have a bad attitude make sure to keep your response reasonable and positive now it's not the time to bad mouth a colleague right A fitting answer would be everyone has bad days if the rudeness is a one time occurrence i'd let it go if something major happens or if it is repeated i'd reach out to my supervisor my concern would be that perhaps the doctor was being rude not because of a bad day but because of dissatisfaction with my work that is a prudent answer coming to the final question in this session of the nurse interview is what do you find most rewarding about being a nurse this is 
a lead in for you to talk about your strengths as a nurse maybe it's about helping patients keeping doctors on task or working with a particular demographic a cool answer would be as a maternity nurse i am there for the moment when people's family grow it's powerful and awe inspiring to witness and i'm so happy to be able to reassure and help women in this big moment especially first time moms oh what an answer now it's your turn the interviewers will always give you a chance to ask questions usually towards the end of the interview so you should be prepared with the appropriate questions Question 1 what is the culture like in this organization Question 2 what kind of training is available do you have any mentorship programs Question 3 do many nurses work overtime here Question 4 what are some of the big challenges nurses face in this organization Question 5 do you offer tuition reimbursement Well there are probably many more questions to be covered in an interview point of view which i will do in my next video so stay tuned if you have subscribed a big thanks and if you have found this interesting and useful and if you haven't yet subscribed please don't forget to subscribe and share with your friends so we'll meet in our next video with another interview question session so until then bye bye